What's up? What's up, Queen Game? For the ones that didn't know, I am a single mother of four. And today, y'all, I had to force myself out the bed. I was just having one of those depressive moments where I just didn't want to do nothing. Didn't want to get up to eat. Didn't want to get up for the kids. No, nothing. But I was like, no, I cannot let the devil win. Get your behind up, girl. It's going to be okay. Because you cannot beat yourself up over things that you cannot control. But I was definitely having one of those moments. So I decided to get up and head to IHOP to go eat a little bit of breakfast and just to clear my head a little bit. I had dropped the kids off to school. So this was just a perfect time to have like a little me time and I actually eat because sometimes when I get into a depressive stage, I tend to not eat. A lot of people eat when they're depressed. I wouldn't touch nothing. I'm just fed up with everything, with life in general, with being a mother, with having all these responsibilities, bills, family, just because the grass is green, the sky is blue. I'm tired of everything, like... I'm so overwhelmed. I don't even know what to do with myself. Like, I'm just trying. That's all I can say. I am trying because I have wanted to give up so many times. I know a lot of single parents, a lot of parents in general, know the feeling of just feeling like it's too much sometimes. Like, when am I going to be able to catch a break? When can I do something for myself? When can I relax? When can I just take a a me time i'm not talking about just no pancakes for 20 minutes i'm talking about a three-day weekend or something like i just need a break y'all this stage of my life is not gonna last forever so this is just a moment like i got better things that's coming in my path better things that's coming in my life and i just gotta just keep praying to God and keep feeding myself and keep the faith to know that everything is gonna be fine. I just, oh my God, y'all, I'm just so overwhelmed. Like, we are supposed to be moving in two days. Two days, y'all, and I have no idea where we are going. So I'm gonna have to pack all this stuff and put it in a U-Haul truck and don't have a destination because I have to wait until the house is ready, so. I'm just all over the place. And who is going to help me move all this stuff? Who going to help me? <laughs> like, I don't talk to my family no more. So I can't ask my brother to help me or anybody else to help me. So it's like, I'm just an emotional wreck right now. I know that God is going to take care of us. But yes, I'm worried. Like, who wouldn't be worried? <laughs> like, I'm a mother. I am a mother that has four human beings depending on me so i gotta get my shit together and just pull pull through pull through and just be strong even though i feel weak at times i have my weak moments but i have to be strong for them little ones so it's gonna happen and it's gonna work out i may be stressed through it but i'm gonna get through it so I'm going to just go in the bathroom like I always do, get in the shower and just cry it all out and just pull my shit together. Doing this all by myself, it's a lot. People don't understand, but it's a lot. This thing is good, y'all. I done cleared the whole freaking plate. I guess I am stress eating. I don't know. <laughs> I don't usually eat, but it is what it is. Y'all, just when I thought I was just having one of those me times, it was time to go get baby Eve. I caught you at nap time. Hmm? Mommy, what's that? You not got me. Oh, I went to, I go home. What does the snack got to do with anything? No, uh, I'm going to bring my wood. I should have left you to take a nap. Put it on. You didn't want to take no nap? Yep. You did? No. <laughs> what a dress. Thank you guys for watching. Your girl is out.
Alright, you guys, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like this video, and comment down below.